right now we are about to head over to bicycle bike shop where we're going to be unboxing my new e-bike from mac fox shout out to mac fox for sending me this new e-bike honestly i can't wait to get this one unboxed because this is something different compared to all the other e-bikes i've just gotten so looking forward to working with mac fox and seeing what what's inside this box it's heavy This one's good. All right, guys, we are currently about to take my first ride on my new Mac Fox e bike. Pretty simple. Turn this up here, turn this on. Oh, that's cool. It has a port where you can charge your phone. That's kind of cool, I ain't gonna lie. Go ahead and hit the switch, turn it on. Uh, has an eco mode, mid mode, and a high mode. We're gonna ride it in mid right now. Yeah, Steezy Films. <sighs> Let's see if this thing can wheelie. Oh! <laughs> okay, it can wheelie, but I gotta be careful. I'm trying to get it to wheelie from a dig. Like that. It has that like motorcycle style throttle. I'm a big fan of the thumb throttles. I wish the rear brakes were on the left side and not the right. Uh, it seems like it's catching some speed now. All right guys, this here is my new Mac Fox e-bike. I've owned the e-bike for about two weeks now and I wanted to give my comprehensive review on the e-bike. So first things first guys, your boy Steezy is a six foot four bike rider, okay? So I am very tall and this bike is a little bit more on the smaller side for me. However, I have no complaints. It's stylish. It breaks necks, guys. I'm talking about, I probably had like 10 people stop me and ask me what it is. Honestly, for the price, you really can't beat it. I think it's roughly around a thousand bucks. I'll have the correct price on the screen, but I think it's around that. Uh, it has like a matte black to it, 20 inch rims, some wide tires. It la it goes about 23 miles per hour on a full charge. But to me, I think that's plenty of fast. It's plenty of fast. You don't need to be going that fast on these e-bikes because I ain't gonna lie. One time I was riding this thing and I was moving and there was a curb and I literally almost missed the curb and I almost like flew over this thing, but I was able to catch my balance. So trust me, 23 miles per hour on an e-bike is pretty fast. So other than that, it's pretty cool. Let me show you the modes. It has three modes. It has an eco mode, it has a mid mode, and it has a high mode. I ride it in mid and high, but preferably if you want to go fast, high is the best mode. Um, it comes with two keys. It has a pedal assist, single speed, not really used to the single speed. I always like have a geared e-bike, but the single speed is cool. You could change that free wheel out. You feel me? Put a little ride out supply, loud free wheel on there if you really want to get stylish. You could even change the gear ratio on here for real, for real, if you really wanted to. I don't know too much about these Mac Foxes. This is my first ever Mac Fox that I've ever owned. The main question I know you guys are gonna ask me is, can I wheelie? Honestly, I can't wheelie, but I'm sure there's people out there who can, and hopefully we'll be able to see if somebody can wheelie this thing. I'm not sure. But comfortability, this thing has a super, super, super comfortable seat, guys, super. And 
you want to get a little passenger work, you feel me? How, how these other Suron guys are, are risen up and getting passenger work on their e-bikes. It definitely has space for two people. It's not the fastest for two people, but on a full charge, you should be straight. Uh, it has this cool front headlight. And I ain't gonna lie, people be pissed at night because that thing is bright. It's almost like a high beam. Let me turn it off. You see it? And trust me, that thing is bright. Don't be fooled. At night, boy, people be pissed. The only thing I didn't like, the rear brakes came on the right side. And I'm used to it being on the left. So the first ride, I'm over here sliding and I slam on this and I almost flew. But overall, guys, this bike is cool. Shout out to Max Fox for sending me this e-bike. Um, I can't willy it, but I'm, I'm gonna try to get some riding clips of me on this thing. Currently downtown West Palm, about to catch some vibes. So although I'm a tall rider, the suggested ride height for this bike is 5'3 and 6'6 six, six tall. If you weigh under 300 pounds, you'll be perfectly fine. It has a super, super comfortable seat. It can handle that kind of strength, so don't be worried about that. This e-bike is such a good commuter bike, guys. I, I just really can't stress that enough. I literally had it for like two weeks now, and I've been having a blast. It has up to 38 miles range-wise. If you have a second battery, you can do 76 miles on this e-bike, but the Mac Fox really killed it with the design on it. You could really use this as a daily commuter. You could use it to get around town, if you live close to downtown or wherever city you live in, it's perfect for riding downtown, riding on the beach, riding through a park. It has off-road 20 inch knobby tires. So you could definitely take it off-road if you felt like it, you know, gravel or something like that. I took it on a little beach path when I first got it in. I, I had fun. So definitely, definitely will recommend you guys check them out. The bike is only a thousand bucks on the website. So I have a link to that in the description below. But check them out, guys. I wasn't able to wheelie my Mac Fox, but my boy BSA, the collab with them, and he's been going crazy on the Mac Fox that he did. And he's been going crazy. He can do combos, um, he can do wheelies, and he be snapping. So I'm gonna put some clips of him putting in some work on his Mac Fox in this video. But y'all definitely go check him out, BSA on Instagram. He has a collab with Mac Fox as well. He's actually the one that told me about mac fox let me reach out and see what we could do see what we can cook and you know i'm glad i'm able to get one of the cool one of their coolest bikes out so it's fairly affordable you feel me a thousand bucks you can't beat it you can't beat the design quality no you can't beat how comfortable it is even though i'm a tall rider you know if you're under six feet this is perfect for you uh, you know if you needed to get to work or whatever the case may be this is a perfect slider so check them out again link is in the description below I'm gonna catch you guys in the next video. So yeah, guys, I'll catch you guys in the next video. Subscribe if you're new to the channel. I'm on the road to 100K subscribers. And a lot of y'all that be watching my videos, don't be subscribed. So hit that subscribe button. I'll see y'all in the next one.